Hey guys, it's Hexer18. How's it going? In this video, I'm going to show you a Backtrack 5 tutorial on how to harvest or collect or gather e emails of a uh, website or a domain in particular. It could be anything that uh, you can think of. I think it would work on anything. So I'm going to test it on a website that I just randomly thought would have maybe a lot of emails and may not have a lot any so we'll just find out what happens here so what we want to do is run backtrack here and um, of course have a target first or someone that you're gonna try to launch this uh, attack or it's not really an attack it's more of uh, information gathering like a footprinting so um, we're going to use University of Washington, and you're probably wondering why are you doing it on a university? Like I said, I'm guessing that the students might have an email, or there might be a lot of emails for this website. So I'm just going to try this university here. I'm not from Washington. I'm not going to tell you where I'm from. So this is not where I'm located. So I'm just, this is a random website, like I said. I'm just going to try something random here. So I'm going to minimize that. We already know what the website is. So I'm going to go to backtrack here. And hopefully it will let me, uh, here we go, zoom in here so you guys can see everything from backtrack. Okay, I got backtrack 5 running in uh, VMware Fusion here on my Mac. So I'm going to show you what you need to do is go to applications backtrack and then go to uh, your Metasploit. So in this case, whoops, exploit tool, exploitation tools, and then the um, the network uh, exploitation tools and Metasploit framework. Or you can just go your terminal and type in uh, cd slash pen test slash exploit slash framework three. Okay. And then you can run the the uh, Metasploit uh, console, which is what we want. I'm sure it would work in the GUI, but I'm more familiar with console. All right, we got console up. Yes, I didn't update it yet. I don't want to update it right now. Um, so I just want to show you guys this cool tutorial here. So um, we search here for uh, collector or gather which is what some other people look for um, I look for collector and here it is the very first one search email collector so I'm just gonna highlight this copy and then just say use and then paste it press enter okay so we don't know what we're gonna do here so we need to type in show options so don't be scared if you guys don't know what to use in Metasploit. Use the show options. It definitely helps you what mo modules to use or options to use. So um, we need to set a domain here. So set domain and then the website uh, washington.edu and then press enter. Okay, it's set. Now you can choose whether or not you want it to search with Bing, Google, Yahoo, or even have it as an out output file. Um, I'm not going to do that. I want to see everything in my terminal here. So, uh, or in the console. And then right now I want to just type run and then it does everything for me. So we just wait here. Shouldn't take too long. Okay. Oh, we found one email. Yay. All right. Um, I'm just going to copy this guy's email, whoever this person is. I do not know who it is. So I'm just going to say copy. Now, here's the fun part. You guys are going to have so much fun doing this. Go on the internet. Go to Facebook. Or not Facebook. Sorry about that. Firefox. I apologize. Uh, Google and paste the email in there. And hopefully you'll see like profiles or something with his email. Um, oh, here we are. Let's try this. And there's that guy. 
this is a guy's email. You can see his email right here, and he has contact information and his mailing address, uh, website. Um, let's see, that will take me to. Yeah, it says Bob's homepage. Everything's right there, and this is telling you from what you're learning here with this credit, this uh, email gathering tool. You can see how unsafe this is by just doing a small scan and then finding people's emails in one Google search. Look what I found. I found emails, or that's his email that we already have, but his faxing, his you know office number, his mailing address everything where he lives at you know Seattle we didn't you know all that good stuff he even has pictures of stuff uh, everything and this is enough information plenty of information to start social engineering so um, tell me what you guys think about this tutorial I wanted to make it brief and quick uh, send me your comments uh, appreciate it guys for uh, sticking to my videos keep in tune for more videos subscribe comment suggest me stuff go at it thanks appreciate it